and Sienna Harris. My name is Ash. I'm the proud father of the kids that you see before you. I know what you guys are thinking. That guy is way too young to be a dad. But I am. I'm very proud of them. Thank you very much. And we also got a couple of special little guests here with us today. Come on out here, guys. These are our youngest members of our household. They'll be performing here very shortly. This here is Savannah Sinclair and Liam Sinclair. Woo! And they'll be showcasing their stuff here real soon. Wow. Thank you, guys. So we are the Ivan Flett Memorial Dancers. We are from Winnipeg, Manitoba. For those of you who might not know where that is, it's way over there. That way or that way. <laughs> but that is where our home is. Our mission and purpose is to bring hope, motivation, and inspiration to people everywhere, young and old, near and far. We travel the world with this dance, hoping to share and spread our culture through the Red River Jig. In doing so, we travel to many, many communities and have gotten so many opportunities, such as participating on Canada's Got Talent. Woo! Yeah, way to represent the culture. And we have also been granted the opportunity to represent our province of Manitoba by getting to go to the uh, North American Indigenous Games in Halifax in, in July. So yeah, that's going to be a good one. Okay. I think I'm going to have a little bit of fun with all of you. I'm going to get all of you involved here somehow, okay? I want all of you to be our judges. We're going to do something with the group here, and we're going to have a little fun with the guys here, okay? So Woo! we're going to have a little jig off within our group. We're going to have a little contest. All right. and what I want you guys to do is just yeah. simply cheer for who you guys think should win. So I'm going to share this story with you guys, okay? And I don't share it to brag about the kids or anything like that. <laughs> I share it because the hard work, the dedication that they put into it, and these are the goals and achievements that they get out of it. So Mikey here, he is a former seven-time world jigging champion. Woo! Yeah. And then Jacob, come on out here, Jake. Jacob grew up, he entered his brother's age category, <laughs> and he dethroned his brother. Aww. So Jacob is a former four-time world jigging champion. And then wouldn't you know it, little sister Sienna, she grew up, she entered her category, and she beat both her brothers. <laughs> so Sienna, because of the whole pandemic thing, she actually retains her title. She is still the two-time world jigging champion. All right. So this is where you guys come into play. We're going to give them two changes each. And then at the end, I want you guys to cheer for who you guys think should win for at least today. How's that sound? Yeah. You guys have a loud cheer out there? They're sleeping. Awesome. Okay, we're going to get this rolling here. We're going to give Mikey here two changes with the Red River Jig. <laughs> Good stuff. He's dancing like he wants it. <laughs> so up next here, we're going to get Jacob with two changes. <laughs> Dancing like he wants it. And Sienna here, oh, coming up with okay. smiles full of confidence. Let's give her two changes of the Red River Jig. <laughs>
here we go. Let's bring up our three dancers here. <laughs> now remember, based on how loud you guys cheer, you guys are going to choose who you think should win. So let's start off with Mikey here. How did Mikey do? <laughs> Jacob? Oh, okay, not bad, not bad. How about Sienna? Okay. Crowd spoke. Boys, you can sit down. That's absolutely awesome. That's fun.